Hello YouTube, this is Asatsu5 and today I'm going to try a mod on my NATO strap for this Wangle Grenade Nero. Uh, I have it in a standard configuration. You see I have a, uh, a lump right here. That's actually uh, a tab from the um, NATO strap when it is um, fitted correctly or as it was designed onto the watch. Now I have a video where I talk about how to set up the NATO where it won't do this. But I recently took it to a uh, jeweler uh, that has my uh, cuckoo clock, by the way. But um, he thought it was weird how I had mine set up, and he set it up like this. And he asked me why I had it the way I had it. I said, well, it's to manage this tag. And he suggested cutting it off and melting it. And I've already knew about this mod, knew, known about this mod, but um, I never actually did it. And I thought it might make for a good video. So we're going to take this very cheap... Um, well, first off, let's um, uh, see how much of a t tab we have. But this is a really cheap NATO, and um, so if I ruin it, it won't break my heart or anything. But probably about half an inch or inch. Um, we'll take this off. And what I'm going to do, as part of the experiment, is use a corridor as a template. Use a corridor as a template. And just to make things interesting, I got a new um, uh, Leatherman Raptor for Christmas. And we're going to use that to cut this. It's not quite the right tool for the job, but I thought I'd enjoy it. This is going to be the dangerous part. By the way, this is my armored Zippo, which is not really a Zippo. It's a torch lighter with the armored Zippo case. And um, I'm going to keep the cordles there. Don't know why. But um, Alright, there's the finished product. Let's see how it looks. I can't say that it's finished the pro finished product yet because I haven't tried it on. I might need to trim some more off. But we'll just, for the sake of fitting, there. As you can see, I no longer have the tab poking out. All I used for this mod, as you saw, was two quarters, a pair of medical shears, which you don't need medical shears, you can have regular scissors as well, but I wanted to play with these, so that's what I used, and a lighter. Happens to be a nautical themed armored Zippo case with, uh, I think this is a Z Plus lighter, a torch lighter insert. Now my, uh, well it's not that bad, I could probably trim a little bit off, but it's really not that bad so wanted to show that to you uh, all right YouTube just thought I'll give a quick update I did do a little bit more fitting uh, off screen because I thought it'd be a little bit boring to show those steps over and over again in the original video this is the finished product as you can see my cutting was it perfect I've had some sewing scissors so probably would have did a little bit better but my brother was cool enough to get me these scissors for um, Christmas some medical shears uh, has all kinds of cool gadgets on it that I would hopefully never have to use. But it's just good to have some good scissors. And um, so, yeah, there's the finished product. The tab doesn't hang out too much. And the average Joe is probably not going to notice the, uh, fit, the fit and finish or the finish on that cut job that I did. But I think just every day it'll look just fine. I wanted to show that to you. That's it. I'm a Satsu 5, and I'm out. Yeah, that's it.